Hey folks, today I'm going to show you how to remove some of the room echo from a video in Premiere Pro. So I'm going to just play this clip here. Oh, There's people that are coming from outside North Africa. You know, somebody I'm doing an interview with and uh, the room he was in uh, is very echoey since he was speaking into his computer. So if you want to do this properly, what you really should do is throw it into Adobe Audition and do a lot of work on it. But you can reduce some of this in Premiere Pro real quickly and what you want to do that to use that is use the d reverb so what i am is i'm in my effects rack here as you can see uh, i've got mine on the lower left yours might be somewhere else depending on your layout if you're not seeing it at all go to windows and go to effects to make sure that it is checked so i'm going to grab my d reverb and i'm just going to drag and drop it onto my project timeline and as you can see in my effects control I added it so I want to jump down to audio 3 because his audio track is on number 3 here when you're in there you can go edit and you'll get a few defaults you can go heavy reverb revibration light reverb uh, reduction and it'll automatically kind of set it and notice what it did there let's say I go heavy and this amount here pushes it all the way up to 80% light and that's really all we're more or less messing with here is this amount something to think about when you're doing this is the higher you put it it's actually going to kind of start to degrade the quality of the audio just a little bit um, so keep that in mind when doing it so you kind of want to try to go the bare minimum you can while still making it sound okay so i'm going to turn it off and play it for just a second Africa, um, the middle east pretty much very echoey so i'm going to turn it back on and then, then via turkey and because obviously turkey is... and so it's still echoey because you know if it were this easy well everybody would uh, be just using this functionality you can throw additional uh, effects on there and eqs and that kind of stuff but this is like the starting point and generally pretty easy one if you're um just worried about just a little bit but that's still a bit not quite right, so I think I actually will throw it up to the heavy level, maybe do an 80% on it's, it. You know, you know, the green dialects are so close to the computer. A little bit better. It's also a bad audio quality just in the sense of the connection. Something else you want to make sure that you've got checked, it'll check it by default is this audio gain. And the reason why you want that checked is what happens is if you have a when you apply the reverb, it actually reduces the audio volume just a little bit. So that having the audio gain checked will actually keep the volume level. And so that's kind of what um, you want to do. This focus on frequencies, you can highlight it and see focus on lower frequencies, mid, high. And um, I generally just kind of leave mine flat. For his, it's kind of actually in the high area. So I might consider actually throwing it to the high and seeing how that sounds yeah. obviously it's only a, well we say it's only a short journey but not too much of a difference uh with just leaving it on focused on all frequencies which to be honest i can tell you anytime i've ever used this that's always where i leave it i don't even bother with the other ones and that's pretty much it this is just a real quick way to do some get rid of some of that room echo and, and what it's doing is just getting rid of that reverb from there you're going to actually probably do a few more adjustments maybe later on i'll do another video uh, where i actually do multiple audio edits in here but i just wanted to do a real quick one if you've just got a little bit of room echo and it's not too bad throw that d reverb on there that'll drop it down just a little bit it's not going to be perfect um, but it certainly is going to be a little bit better than it is. All right. Hope you found that useful and have a good day.